Hey guys, welcome to the Selfless Bandit Show vlog. Uh, we got one day away from Pharma Palooza. I'm gonna be the MC. I'm gonna be announcing all the bands and shit. Uh, it's gonna be a really good time. I did it last year in September. That was called Farmageddon. This one's gonna be called Pharma Palooza. It's in Kakan. I don't believe this will be the third year running. I gotta get my details correct on that though. So it's called uh, the. The grounds are called the Broda Zafa Sound Garden Field, I believe. Yeah, so if you literally if you Google the Broda Zafa, it comes up in Kakana, Wisconsin at where this festival's gonna be at. <laughs> Okay, so this is Kelly. Uh, is a client of mine. I sometimes give her rides to work and stuff. So uh, this is what I'm going to try to do with the vlog. So I got a couple questions for Kelly, and Kelly's going to participate today. Uh, Kelly, what uh, if there is anything that you can change in the world? What would it be? Women's rights. Women's rights. Okay. All right. All right. Uh, can you elaborate a little more on that? Um, that we get equal pay. We get equal rights. We have. Um, control over our bodies and mm -hmm. what we can do awesome cool cool all right uh now what is something that you are grateful for my family your family you got a big family Definitely or small? a huge family oh yeah <laughs> five children and two mothers stay with us so oh that's wonderful big family that is so cool is there any of them you want to say hi to Hey, mama. <laughs> There's so many of them. All right, and then the last question is: Are you happy in general in life? Are you happy? I am happy in life. You are? Yes, I live a happy life. Okay, wonderful. Can you explain that again. Yeah. So oh, wow. something that happens to me and Stephen <laughs> all the time is we have very good coincidences and we're just like very synced with the universe. Uh, so. He, you know, just weird things. Weird things always happen to us. And here's one thing that just happened to him, actually. He came across this bike. Tell us about it, buddy. Very strange coincidence today. Early in the morning, I bought this bike. Then I decided I'm going to go out to Wheel and Sprocket. And what I buy, I don't know if you want to zoom in on it to see it. I go into Wheel and Sprocket, and I see this little, this is actually a bell. <laughs> yeah, it's actually about, it's called Lucky Cat Bell, okay? And it looks just like that. Now, I get in my car, I leave, five minutes later I see a sign for a garage sale, Roman sale. I go up, the very first thing I see is none other than a Lucky Cat. The same exact Lucky Cat. <laughs> and it's a little funny. solar panel. See, hey, Dad, his, his little arm moves actually when you like. Anyways, so cool. get a shot of both of them. And it's the exact, it's the exact same. same cat. It's the Lucky Cat. It's you know what I'm saying? Cat, it's a, I guess it's a little different in its symbols, but mm -hmm. what's the what's the chances of that happening? Right. Exactly. Exactly. Coincidence and synchronicity is what I call it. Synchronicity of the highest level. Yep. And that shit happens to us all the time. That's why we are fucking interesting. Do you have the GoPro on right now? Yep. Okay. Right near these. I am not sure. I think it's butternut squash, Waltham butternut, but that's why I got these things in here to rail them up. Got some homegrown peas right here. One of my favorite. These are actually going to climb right up here. They'll spire around. These things will be like solid cones. In this middle one, I actually have sunflowers too, and they'll actually climb up the sunflowers. This is like my pride and joy though. This is like my favorite thing of all. Actually, this is strawberry plants. There's three strawberry plants in here. Every flower on here is actually a, a soon to be strawberry. I'm guessing I got about three dozen strawberries each bed, each one of these probably. So self-sustainability strawberry plants are like the best. You know, they're super cheap to buy. And there's super shallow root systems, throwing up some beds, put up some wire fencing. That's just chicken wire. You know, I just bet that with my hands. I can come in here like this, rip that open if I want to. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Over here, I have half a bed because I only have, looks like zucchini or something in here, but I just planted some seeds for some other things. Uh, peas here, I forgot what this is. I don't even know what that is. And I have Miracle to mixed in. Empty bed because I have some things going in. Zucchini Elite. Right here is my tomato plants. I did six a piece or five a piece. That's, this is my pepper bed. This is my tomato one. And this year, I can't remember exactly what I have. I thought I kept the tag anyways. 
that's my tomato plants. Right here is actually my beast of a pumpkin plant. I have it all protected and I'm actually gonna grow, spiral it up through here and it'll actually grow over here, okay? I, right now I have peas in here and they're gonna shoot above the pumpkins and climb in here, same concept. I just threw freaking chicken wire over this thing, you know? Hey, come here! Fuck off! Hey! <laughs> oh, so anyways... <laughs> you just put some chicken wire over stuff, because we got I got rabbits and stuff all over the place, so just chew this stuff up. I don't worry about, like, tomatoes and peppers, because they don't go for those. Pumpkins, either. These are actually my pride and joy, too, besides my strawberries. I love my peppers. Peppers, strawberries, and tomatoes are actually the most expensive of all things at the grocery store. So those are like the three I really like to focus on. I actually have some super cool ones this year. Red Knight. I have different kinds. One kind is Red Knight. And I, where's my other tags? Of course, jalapeno. Gotta have jalapeno. So these are my pepper plants. And th that's it. Just in this circle I have. I actually took a, got a tire from one of my projects for my property services business. And then I found this out on someone's curb. I just stuck that in there. And I actually got peas and cucumbers growing here. This is actually a cucumber tire. This is what I'm gonna call it. And then one cucumber plant's actually gonna crawl right up here. And a little flower and you can just pick your cucumbers off here. And I'm gonna make some pickles! And I'm gonna make some pickles! 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 And I'm gonna make some pickles! <laughs> so that, this is my little gardener. Oh! my grapevine that's my grapevine in the middle and it's really flowering right now you may not be able to see but it's actually budding it's going to start flowering next and then these are all going to be grapes and this whole thing actually in here you want me to crawl in here this whole thing in here is actually a compost pile in there i combined it all my green fertilizer and vegetable scrap from my kitchen to reduce the tonnage in the waste landfill deposits and stuff uh I put my debris in here actually, just mix that all up so I don't have to have an extra compost pile. I put it right in with my grapevine. So thanks a lot. This is at my, my little garden, circle garden area. Sweet. Yes, I do. Uh, just so you know, when this thing starts up, this is your release. One time. It's like brand new. I am not normally like this, guys. Yeah, he is. Yeah, he it's, is. He's definitely like this all the time. What? You guys want to try it out or something? No, that's okay. <laughs> There's right, plenty here, more here, over here, here to clap. Right. Yeah. There's a lot of grass here where you can test it out oh, with. Yeah. yeah, it's just unbelievable. I can't, I can't believe I won this doggy basket. It's like I won. <laughs> the mm -hmm. reason why I'm so crazy about it is because I went in yesterday. I bought one ticket. I joked with the counter chick. She told me, she's like, we're going to draw it in like three hours. You know, and we'll give you a call. I'm like, I will talk to you in three hours. Yeah. And she actually called her three hours. <laughs> I was like, are you kidding me? So we're on episode two of a uh, selfless panda vlog. Okay. And uh, we, <laughs> we we made it, we, we're gonna launch the first uh, video probably tonight. And then uh, we got the, we're recording the second video today. Is it okay that you guys are in the vlog? Would you, is that okay? Oh yeah, Completely oh, yeah okay? that's fine. Awesome, cool, cool, cool. Oh, that's funny, you guys just hack them. Selfless panda. Okay. Yeah. Oh, you guys just <laughs> yep, happened yep, to pull yep. up and he, we were sitting here talking. We were watching the videos of yeah. me and him screwing around last time. Maybe yesterday, yeah. I actually have a character called Psycho Steve where I, he talks to me about stuff and I go, crazy on it uh -huh. and she lit up and she was like oh wow that is so nice i said i do want food though so i ordered my food i said i'm gonna eat my taco <laughs> I, do food, I, I do want food though i do want food though lady we'll pick four more one for every one of the chicks that's inside working behind the counter so you can go and eat their tacos <laughs> <laughs> i would like to on a couple of them <laughs> So I do that. I go out of the old bush. I stooped out. I picked one off. I start picking another one off. Guess what? The manager bitch bag that no one likes there who's a fucking cunt bag to hurt everybody else. Comes walking out. She said, sir, do not touch my flowers. I said, so I'll tell you what. 
go fucking bitch at me for doing something fucking nice for your employees. You fucking bitch man. I actually took off running towards my car. She, I looked in my rearview mirror and she fucking walked back into the store holding the flowers. Holy shit. Are you wanted right now? By the police? What? I said, are you wanted by the police right now? No! Not yet! <laughs> That does it for the Selfless Panda show vlog episode two. Uh, so tomorrow I actually am going to be the MC for Pharmapalooza. It's a Tinka uh, Kana. I believe I mentioned it in the beginning of the episode. If you want, fucking go back, check it out. Yeah, share, like, and subscribe. I appreciate you guys. Love you. Bye.